Yeah. Yeah. Quicker. Eight. Nope. Hold on. Fell asleep. Gotta love technology. Oh, yeah. When it works, it's wonderful. Oh, yeah. The it's rest all, of the time. It's all about it's, the user. It helps if it was on the slideshow. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you could press that play button and that was what it done. Mm -hmm. That's right. It's I wasn't even aware that it was not ready. Oh. I think, yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, so, Katie's not here, but I was going to surprise her. There's, there's one uh, uh, Christmas song, supposedly, because this is supposed to not be a Christmas song. When they wrote it, it's supposed to be for every season, but we think of it as a Christmas song. <laughs>
we are lost without you. We, uh, you know, it's been a hard couple of weeks. We know that um, you have, you are, the will is still being done, and you're still continuing to come through. Uh, pray that we are so desperate that we're always with you. Thank you, Jesus.
So, being born in the 90s, I give Frankie a really hard time because he loves singing songs from the 90s. 1890s. <laughs> 1890s. <laughs> and <laughs> we, we give him such a hard time about it. But this is uh, one of my favorite songs. And it, it wasn't in the original set that Frankie sent out earlier this week. I asked him to put this song in. And it's just crazy that the last couple of weeks, Frankie and I were talking about this earlier, the last couple of weeks have just been weird. Just, it's hard to explain. Like, you can feel the, the spiritual battle going Absolutely. on. Absolutely. Oh. It, it's, it's rough. And... Uh, a couple weeks ago, I, I preached on Sunday. Frankie was gone. And I was at such a high after that Sunday. I felt so encouraged. And just, I've never felt like that. <laughs> I've preached a few times, and that was the highest I've ever been. And it felt good for like four days after that. I was ready for it. And then the, ne- <laughs> the following weekend, my truck broke down twice in three days. And and since then, it's just been one thing after another after another. And every time, it's really hard when we're in situations where we just seem to be getting punch after punch. And we don't know why. We don't understand why. We don't know where what we can do. But we have to remember, and it's always encouraging to remember the gospel that we have in Jesus. And that even though we get attacked spiritually and things seem not to be going our way. Everything is going our way in Jesus. Amen. And I, the scripture that I always think of uh, is James chapter 1. I just, it's one of those that is often, I don't want to say overquoted because I don't know how you can overquote the Bible, but, but James chapter 1 is always my go to. He says, verse 2, count it all joy, my brothers, when you meet trials of various kinds. For you know that the testing of your faith produces steadfastness. And let steadfastness have its full effect, that you may be perfect and complete, lacking nothing. And that made, made me think of uh, Romans. Was the one in Romans we talked about? Yeah. Uh, Romans 5. five. Romans 5. Test to see how fast I can flip through my pages. Yes. Romans 5. <clears throat> Therefore, since we have been justified by faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ. Through him we have also obtained access by faith into this, into this grace in which we stand. And we rejoice in hope of the glory of God. Not only that, but we, re- we, we rejoice in our sufferings, knowing that suffering produces endurance, endurance produces character, and character produces hope. And hope does not put us to shame, because God's love has been poured into our hearts through the Holy Spirit who has been given to us. It's funny how the world wants to constantly argue with this book. They'll find every little thing to nitpick 
and try to disprove it. But there's an answer for every single question that we have in, this, in our lives. And it's God, God provides, and He provided, provided us everything we need in His Word. And it's encouraging to me, and I hope it's encouraging to you all. Just a reminder that through His Son Jesus Christ, who was born, came into this world, holy man, holy God, lived a perfect life, taught us how to connect with God, build a relationship with God, and then died on a cross for our sins. And then the better part, on the third day, jumped out of the grave. <laughs> How often we forget about that part, except on Easter. <laughs> but he's still alive today. 2,000 years later, they can't kill him. No matter, hard, no matter how hard they try. But he's still alive, and he's going to come back. And one day we'll all be together with him in paradise. And I can't not wait for that day. Remember the closer you get to God, the more times you get. Absolutely. Yep. And Jesus said, you will get tribulation in the world. But be of good cheer, because I have come to overcome the world. Yep. And I was just going to say that. Yeah. So your, your sermon must have been exceptional for all of the enemy's <laughs> attacks, because you hit a nerve, yep. and he was hitting back. But thankfully, God wins in the end. Absolutely. That's all that matters. God wins. That's why it's so important to know the word. Absolutely. And you know the truth that's in there. It yeah. gives you that hope. And the Holy Spirit, like, it's so strong. Absolutely. Right when you need it, here's the scripture. Yeah. Always. Yeah. It's weird how that happens. Yeah. 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 Absolutely. Do you want to pray? You want me to pray? I'll pray. Okay. One. Nice word. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. God, thank you so much for your encouragement to the Holy Spirit. Uh, even through the hardships, um, there's always a ray of hope, and that's because you are good, and you are faithful, and you are kind, and generous, and graceful, and uh, merciful, and you're jealous of us. You want us all, uh, not just uh, on Sundays or a little part, but everything, the bad, the good, the ugly. You want it all because you're the only one who can save us. You're the only one who can heal us and turn us um, from a grave to a garden. And, uh, God, thank you so much for the tribulations and the trials and yes. sufferings. Um, even though we get lost in them sometimes and we mm. want to give up, um, God, I pray that uh, we will still have that hope um, and the peace that passes all understanding that the world really can understand. That God, through all these trials, uh, we definitely have peace in you. Thank you for letting us run back to you and hold your hand and sit on your lap. I get to see a great father um, who loves his children. Mm -hmm. And uh, we just thank you for that. We thank you for letting us be the bride of Christ and being beautiful in your sight, even if the world thinks we're not. Uh, God, thank you for your love and your mercy. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. 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 I love this song, so it's a little fast, so that's good.
God, thank you that we could uh, be together tonight to uh, worship you and to know that you are uh, Almighty God, the creator of everything. You're the beginning and the end, uh, the first and the last, uh, and the Alpha and Omega. And, uh, God, we just thank you that you are so worthy of everything. No matter what we lose, no matter what we uh, hurt or things that go rough, we know that you are you're in control, not us. Thank you. Uh, thank you that you're wiser, smarter than mm -hmm. us. And uh, God, I, I just pray that we will follow you and not have to worry about what this world does. Thank you for your love and mercy. Thank you for letting us be in church today. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. You're my Prince of Peace. You're my Prince of Peace, and I will live my life for you. Thank you, Nick. Boy, that owl went fast. Yeah, that was wow. <laughs> <laughs> so, two things. I'm so glad you're here. Uh, it's good. Can I hug you? The well is hosting oh, community Thanksgiving. Yeah, it's over on Thanksgiving Day. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, um, that's too bad. We have some posters. Look, uh, come help Thanksgiving. If you guys can think of places to put some around, put some around. Oh, that one more. Oh,